I call Green Gables a campus. It's a 74 acre campus that was designed for the utmost sustainability. There's something about this place that's inspiring, that frees your mind and isolates your thoughts. It's really a place that's hard to describe entirely, but it's really kind of like a magical wonderland. We've got three pools on the estate. On the other side of the property, we've got vegetable and herb gardens, an entire fruit orchard. So within a contained area, you've got your own farmer's market. Part of the grounds that I know the people we've walked the property with are most inspired by are the olive gardens and oak trees and natural pastures. It's a place we find for reflection and creation that's larger than life. The views are unobstructed and will remain that way. If you look over your vistas, you see just acres and acres and miles of redwood forest sequoias and all these indigenous trees in California. And then you come to our property and we keep that horticulture flow going through from the elm grove we have to the olive gardens and the oaks planted everywhere. You mix that with all your own personal indigenous landscaping and it's another way to personalize this property. It's got grand scale with small moments of intimacy, which is hard to duplicate. The next chapter of Green Gables is your vision, with the canvas already painted by a master architect in nature's finest setting. This is a multi-generational family compound for the ages.